Lorraine Kelly paid tribute to lovely TV star Anne Diamond following the news she has been diagnosed with cancer. GB News star Anne Diamond has been away from her breakfast show on the station since January 1. Amid growing concern from fans, the 68-year-old revealed she has been battling cancer during Thursday evening's Dan Wooten Tonight. Paying tribute to Anne, Lorraine Kelly explained to ITV viewers how she has known her for a long time. She added Anne is a lovely woman as she wished her a speedy recovery. It came as Anne also announced she'd be making a return to GB News this weekend after months away to undergo treatment. We've got some really sad news, bad news, actually, Lorraine stated on her self-titled ITV show. She continued, Anne Diamond has given us a health update. The show played a part of Anne's interview in which she emotionally explained, I haven't been on a world cruise which is what I know social media has been saying, I'm well known now for loving cruises. It's been a fight against breast cancer, that's what it's been. Five months later, I'm still not at the end of the journey but I'm through it enough to come back to work. Glad she is back at work, shush is a lovely woman, Anne, Lorraine commented following the clip. She continued, I've known her for a very long time and shush has had a tough time, doctor, Amir, as everybody is going through breast cancer. TV doctor Amir replied, she has indeed, TV legend there Anne Diamond, she reported that she had a double mastectomy following the diagnosis of breast cancer. She said she got that diagnosis on the same day she got her OBE, so that would have been incredibly hard for her. But Shush has been off work at GB News for six months, Shush is going back to work this weekend. Shush is not the only one, Amy Dowden has also said Shush has had surgery for breast cancer and Shush is embarking on treatment now but Shush is remaining positive and we wish them both well. He added, and what this highlights is that we've got to all be aware, men and women, of the symptoms of breast cancer. It will affect one in seven women it does affect men as well and of course, we highlighted this in our campaign. Absolutely, Lorraine responded, we wish everybody going through that and living through that, we do wish you well.